Grateful while humbled to be the best graduating student of medical science in medicine from the University of Guyana, 24-year-old Ashana Singh, who was born and raised in the community of Caneville East Bank Zemarara, spoke of her journey in pursuing her degree in Bachelor of Medicine, Bachelor of Surgery. My journey has been a truly remarkable one. There were some rough waters, some rougher than others, mm -hmm. but all in all, I have matured and I believe that throughout my journey, I've gained so much experience over the years. When I started out medical school, I started out as a teenager and today I'm 24 years old and it has truly been um, many challenges along the way, but uh, many sleepless nights. Um, Many sacrifices were made, but all in all, I have um, matured as an individual and uh, I am so grateful to have completed this program today. Singh, who is the second of three children, was honored by the Prime Minister of Guyana, Mark Phillips, with a gold medal and the Rolf Richard Prize in Clinical Medicine. It was definitely a privilege. Um, that was me met meeting him for the very first time. And he had so many words of encouragement. And I think that moment and that being there receiving a medal from him is truly a memorable moment that will stay with me forever. And I'm so grateful to have received it from such an honorable person. Coming from the community of Caneville, which has been plagued with many crimes over the years, the future doctor intends to be a positive role model. She highlighted the community is filled with many intellectual and talented youths. I was actually born and raised in Caneville, and I am so grateful to have come out from there as a successful person. And I trust that my story will be an inspiration to the youths especially of Caneville. And there was one time my teacher in high school, he told us that it's not where you came from, but it's where you're going. And that is something that I, over the years, have, you know, has, has stood with me throughout time. And uh, Caneville has definitely has a lot of potential. And there are a lot of youths that certainly needs to be recognized as well. And and there's so much more to come out of it. Yes, we hear of a lot of crimes in Caneville and a lot of bad stuff, but there's also the good side. And today I, I'm honored to have, to be a, first of all, a villager of Caneville and to, and to show others and to show people across Guyana and worldwide that we definitely have a lot of, a lot of persons who come out with good grades at CSEC, good grades at CAPE, and definitely some remarkable individuals who contribute significantly to society. The fascination of learning about the human body at a young age is one of the reasons for the Caneville residents in pursuing her dreams in the medical profession. Throughout my high school life, I fell in love with the sciences. I was actually in the science stream and I became fascinated about the human body and everything that it entailed. And so when I finished high school, I began volunteering with numerous medical um, organized, nonprofit organizations and they would have, we would have um, done outreaches throughout Guyana. So when the opportunity presented itself for me to do medicine, that is where I, you know, I decided because if you put, you know, having a love to help people and being fascinated about the human body, you put those two together, I thought that medicine is the best fit for me. For Channel 2 Headline News, Esther Sobers.